Script Drop is a uh, prescription delivery service, and uh, our second product is medication reminders to allow patients to be more adherent with their medication. I'm a developer by trade, but I've also had this side of entrepreneurship that I've always delved into, from doing independent consulting to having my own web design shop fresh out of college to making apps. The opportunity that I took to, to build that experience led me at a healthcare IT company where I met my co-founder, Nick. And he was working on some things on the side, and I was working on some things on the side, and believe it or not, we were in the lunch line, and he heard me over talking to someone else, like, hey, you're working on stuff? I'm working on stuff too. Let's see if there's something that we can do together. And then from there, that's kind of how we kicked everything off from our other ventures that we had within our nine to fives and trying to do entrepreneurship, which ultimately led to Script Drop. Our healthcare experience led us to this. We took a look at the data and noticed a trend that after a patient goes to the pharmacy, about 32% of the time, they don't come back to pick it up. So we dug deeper and found like, hey, we might be able to come up with a solution for this. Went through several different iterations of the product to ultimately land at where we're here now, but the data told the story and we wanted to capitalize on that. I think building a company is one of those things that if you ask every person that had a successful company that have something different. But my take on it is if you start small but gather small wins, then you eventually build up to something big. You still want to have your eye on the prize and the big roadmap, but if you can stack up those smaller wins, and that might be going to market, talking to customers, and seeing if your idea is really valid.